So first you're gonna go to emblem.finance, that's our DAP. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna go over to My Vaults. And what you're gonna do is you're then gonna click on Not Minted. And you're gonna see your Megapunk here. And so what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on it. And you can see here the owner is 000, which means it's not minted. You can come down, you can see your ordinal inscription. You can even click on View NFT and it'll show you your exact ordinal inscription. And you can even check the ver and verify the address with BC1 and you can see it ends in LS. And you can come here and you can see the same address. So what you need to know is that in order to mint a vault, you need first 250 Koval. But luckily, if you are minting within the first 48 hours of being airdropped, then you don't have to cover that fee. But what's going to happen here is if you've never used Emblem Vault before, you're going to hit sign and nothing's going to happen. And that's because you still have to approve Koval. So what I'm going to show you, what you have to do is you have to come hit create, hit next, type in any, any random words that you want, choose any sort of image that you need, and then you're gonna hit approve Koval right here. See, you're gonna hit approve, hit use default, you're gonna hit next, you're gonna approve that, and this allows you to uh, mint your vault. It allows you to prove, approve Koval so that you can mint the vault. Of course, there's no Koval waived fee during this process, but all you need to do is go hit approve Koval. And so then once you're done with that, what you're doing is you're hitting my vaults, going back to not minted, and then you're clicking on this. And then all you gotta do is just come down and hit mint. And you can see there's gonna be a gas fee associated with it. You're gonna see down here, it says verifying signature, and then a gas fee is gonna come up, right? Uh, depending on the gas, we can see right now the gas is about 24 and it's at 20 or it's at $17. So you're going to hit confirm and it's going to mint. And you can see down here it says that it's going to mint. And when you're done with that and you see this where it says approve minting and all these other things, then you're good to go. You're also going to want to hit here to approve minting. This is how you unlock it. So if you ever want to remove this asset from this vault, you're gonna to have to make sure that you hit approve minting. It should actually say approve minting slash burning, but that is gonna be important to where, if you ever want to remove this inscription, you're gonna hit unlock vault, get private keys, and this burns the vault, it burns this NFT. So you can see here there's a, an address, an owner address. If you hit unlock keys, it burns this vault, and then it'll reveal the private keys so that you could go import it into any other wallet that you'd like. And you can come here to even confirm that your vault is safe. It looks like it hasn't rendered on Luxray yet, but you can see here on OpenSea that it's still, oh, there it is. There's your asset, right? You can even hit refresh if you want. You come down here, it says all ordinals BTC, all Bitcoin, it shows you everything. If you wanna sort it by all ordinals, you can sort it by all ordinals and you can see all of these different ordinal collections that are inside Emblem Vault. You could also head over to ordinals.market and by this time, hopefully it'll be listed. We've worked with the team to make sure that it gets listed. You could trade on there or you could go trade on this level as well, depending on the experience that you want and the fees that you would like to pay. So without further ado, and you can even go here and you can see the transaction on the blockchain, on the Bitcoin Explorer. You can even come back in here. This is how you access it. Again, look, you can see that it's vaulted. You can transfer it here. This is how you unlock. You can also go to our YouTube page, Emblem Vault. And it'll. this is where a bunch of tutorials are. You can see here, ornal tutorials. We also have a medium, if you need, Emblem Vault, and it'll show you even more tutorials. We got you on lock, on deck, with all the different tutorials that you need. So I just wanna say congrats, guys. You're now the first 10K collection to be vaulted with Emblem Vault. Uh, we had a successful time and uh, become familiar with Emblem Vault. And if you have any questions, Hop into our Discord. It's pretty easy to find, just right here. 
circuits of value and you can come in if you have any issues come down to ordinal support or questions or general and we'll help you with anything that you need all right guys congratulations mega punks here we go